I'd like to conclude the pathophysiology of the pulmonary system by talking about two fairly common occurrences. One is alveolar consolidation and the other one is pneumothorax, briefly. Alveolar consolidation means a condition in which the alveoli become filled with fluid. It can be a very liquid fluid, almost pure water, or it can be a very protonaceous, exudative type fluid and it consolidates, meaning it fills the alveoli. And you can, you, can, you can imagine what the physiology will become. If I fill the alveoli, I'm certainly not going to be able to ventilate it. So it's going to lead to ventilation perfusion mismatch, indeed a decreased VQ ratio. So what are the causes, the etiologies of alveolar consolidation? Well, the alveoli can really fill with only three things, blood, pus, or water. So there are conditions that cause bleeding into the lung, into the alveolar spaces. One of the most common, even though it's, not, it's a very rare occurrence overall, is good pasture syndrome. This is a type 2 hypersensitivity where we make autoantibodies against the basement membrane of certain capillaries. Uh, this occurs most frequently in the renal capillaries, the glomerulus, and the uh, pulmonary uh, capillaries around the alveoli. We therefore destroy the capillary and we have bleeding into the interstitial space and that will ooze or seep into the alveolus and hemoptysis would be one of the clinical signs of that. You cough up blood. Uh, so that is a cause of alveolar filling. Any other cause of bleeding within the bronchial tree, carcinoma within the bronchi, can erode a vessel, bleed into it, and that will just trickle down to the alveolus. Uh, uh, the other cause of or etiology of consolidation, meaning filling of the alveoli, is pus, white blood cells. And you can imagine how many causes there are for pus or white blood cells. Infection. Any infection within the lower bronchial tree will lead to filling of the alveoli with white blood cells, mainly leukocytes uh, and neutrophils. So pneumonia, bronchoalveolar pneumonia. Uh, bronchial pneumonia is infection more in the bronchioles. Alveolar pneumonia or bronchoalveolar pneumonia is where the alveoli uh, fill up with pneumonia. Again, you're not going to ventilate, so everything we talked about, decreased ventilation, is going to take place and lead to consequences. And the third one is water. What causes